So now we're going to head into the GCPD, and once we're inside, um, we're going to start sneaking our way through the corridors and office ways of, uh, of the building. Um, the narrative inside the GCPD is, uh, is, is of a department that's very much in, in chaos. Um, earlier tonight, the commissioner, police commissioner Loeb was killed by the Black Mask, and uh, the, the events that take place as a result of that are um, that the, the corrupt police department, many of the people don't know where their next paycheck's coming from because Loeb was so corrupt he was organizing his own, um, his own payments within the department. Um, and uh, we've got something of a power vacuum as a result of him leaving. Stand a chance against that many armed men. I can use death strokes remote claw to pass above their heads undetected. Alright, listen up. While well, you jokers were playing cleanup for a black team. Deal with our pal Black Mask. If any of us can kill the bat before the assassins get to him, we get the bounty. All 50 million dollars of it. And for those of you who ain't too good with the mask, that means we all retire early. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. Let's take him down then. Yeah. What are we waiting for? Enough. I need to silently take down that guard in order to move on. Whatever they put you on. So with the number of armed men in that last room, there's no way most players could uh, take on so many enemies. We want a situation which is very dangerous for Batman, but one where he's not inclined to engage the enemies around him. So it, it's, uh, it's a little bit different to some of the interiors that you've seen in the other Arkham games, but uh, we believe uh, something that's very unique for the uh, prequel space to see Batman um, sneaking around and avoiding police officers this point in his career, he's not really understood. He's, he's kind of a combination between an urban myth and uh, some sort of um, misunderstood outlaw. So um, uh, I think it's kind of different. It's kind of unusual uh, and also very appropriate for the early career of Batman. Answer for dropping me off that rooftop, buddy! 
No, you have to answer to me. How does this disruptor work? Ask one of the pigs. They got it in evidence lockup. How about we take a little walk up to the roof? Okay. Okay, you win. It it jams weapons, overrides electronic locks, all right? Now you gotta let me go. How'd that work out for you last time? Oh. yourself to a shelter you kidding that's where they round us up so anarchy is a character that's well intentioned in our game and uh, he has a connection with the homeless community inside uh, inside Gotham um, that same community gets harassed by the the same cops that Batman are, is dealing with right now so uh, we want to create a little bit of granularity a little bit of uh, a little bit of grit in the, I guess the relationships there between the characters to show that um, whilst Anarchy is misguided by Batman's um, terms, that's how he sees him, um, he's also a character with some depth. Now another character we're going to see here is Barbara Gordon, someone who's been, uh, the players of the other Arkham games would be very familiar with as Oracle. Uh, as she, she grows older, um, People who are fans of the lore know she becomes Batgirl, and then eventually, after she get, becomes injured, she becomes uh, Oracle. Um, uh, we haven't actually seen her in the other games, but we've heard her voice a lot. Um, her relationship with her bat with her father is is kind of complex at this point. She's in her teens, and um, she's developing her own ideas about the world, her own ideas about values. Um, it's kind of interesting, her relationship between Batman and her father. Um, her father, James Gordon, he represents law, but Batman represents justice. And those things are very similar, but they're not exactly the same. And like uh, a lot of teenagers do, she's starting to rebel against her parents and, and really figure out uh, where she stands on things. So uh, that's the end of our demo here in, uh, in the GCPD. I hope you've enjoyed seeing it. Um, Batman Arkham Origins is out on October 25th on PS3, Xbox 360. Wii U and PC. Um, there's also Batman Arkham Origins uh, Blackgate, which uh, is out on the same day on PlayStation Vita and 3DS. Uh, check them both out.